Hey, we are so excited to have you here in the land of enchantment, Albuquerque, New Mexico. Boy, I tell you, we are blessed. We are blessed indeed today. Woo! Once I went back, then I got involved at CNM, and I became every officer they had from Black and Minority Student Union uh, president to all the way up to president of student government before I left, after being vice president and secretary of the entire student body at CNM. It was difficult because adults learn different than people that are in regular school, you know. Right. We're usually um, reminded by what we've already lived through and what we know, and then we just bring that information back. and. And, uh, and then we learn like that. I met Bonnie when I started working here 13 years ago. And uh, we worked together. We used to go out to schools and we used to drag our equipment around and teach kids uh, how to do video and so forth. You know, we're friends. You know, I love Bonnie. She's a wonderful person. In terms of working with her, she's, she was always the person who brought a lot of enthusiasm, a lot of energy to everything we did. She felt that, you know, after she came here, she had to really develop herself a lot, and she was kind of lost, and, and uh, CNN uh, really helped her focus and gave her some sense of, 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 of uh, self-esteem. She, she learned a lot there, and it gave her the confidence that she needed, you know, to be successful in everything else that she was doing. She knew that after that experience, she could, she could do things. She could, she could accomplish things. In New Mexico, I would also say it's not having the support that people sometimes need to embark on endeavor like college. We have a lot of first generation college students here and so they're going it alone basically. They don't have role models to help them. Bonnie has inspired me to do the work that I'm doing today and those that know me and those that don't. I, I work as a community organizer and it's because of Bonnie Greathouse that I'm doing the work that I'm doing today and for that I am extremely grateful to her. She's been an inspiration to me and to so many other people as well. I think that Bonnie can help adult basic education a lot by being a role model but also um, in helping people speak for themselves and helping people realize that they can reach their full potentials. That's my purpose in the community, to help other people that didn't have the advantages that I had. What I liked about CNN was they not only nurture you as you come in, but you got children. I still had a child that were considerate of that with child care and stuff. Not only that, it was in walking distance of where I live. Right. But most of all, it gave me the confidence to know that I could walk in the world with everyone else like anybody else, and I could be just as successful as anyone else. And so I always give a lot of credit to CNN and what they've done. So when the Bridges Opportunity Program came along, I continued to volunteer here at Channel 27 until they were nice enough to let me be Vice President of the Board of Directors here. I think that she's an example of what people can do uh, when they're in desperate straits and they need a way out. And it's possible, it's possible to to be a success, it's possible to save yourself from those situations and, 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 and make something really great out of your life. And so she's a perfect example of that for anybody out there watching this, you know, you can do it too.